um, I never saw my mother cry. Well, okay, there was that one time in about 1976, but the point is whatever it was that would get her to that point had to be big, really big. And in general, tears just weren't her thing. Getting on with it was her thing. And being busy was her thing. And being in touch and reaching out and taking care of people who needed taken care of, those were her things. So she was 87 years old. She was fighting two kinds of cancer, but she was still working still driving, still going for walks, still making homemade chicken soup for the next family occasion, still really running the show in so many ways. That was early last March, and that was about six weeks before she died. And that's when I wrote this song from her perspective, as best I could interpret it, having known her from my beginning to near her end. And it's called Don't Cry Yet. Still impart wisdom, you can still make me smile. Don't cry yet, don't shed a tear. I can still do the jumble, sit and chat for a while. Don't cry yet, I'm still here. I can still make decisions, I can still bake a treat. Don't cry yet. When I'm standing so near, I can still clean the files out, keep the kitchen neat. So save every tear, every memory stored inside of here. Save it until I know that I finally found I've done my job and it's time for me to go. So don't cry yet, I'm still here. I can still have opinions and encourage prayer. Don't cry yet, don't shed a tear. I can book up my schedule, I can plan to be there. I can wait to the sunshine. Soft and low. I can still tell a story. I can learn. I can grow. So save every tear, every memory stored inside of here. Save it until I know that I finally found. Soften the fall, don't cry yet, don't shed a tear. I can still say I love you at the end of a call. I can still say I love you at the end of a call. La 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 la. la. <laughs> 